With me today in Patient Prudent Studios is Dr. Barry Polanski, who I have followed for since all my career in dentistry and dental consulting. I've followed his blog at DowDentistry.com. I've read his book uh, from the beginning. The, the first one was uh, The Art of Examination. The second was Art of Case Presentation, and now uh, The Complete Dentist. And, and, and really what I've gotten from um, your, your writings is your focus on people and how much you place that, that you place that above uh, everything else um, in a focus obviously on yourself as a dentist, but also on your patients and, and your team members. At Patient Prism and all the companies that I've started over the last six years, uh, all the new ones have started, I've always focused on, you know, what's, what's the most important uh, objective when I'm dealing with a potential client or, or vendor or whoever it is. And I think, it, and I, I've, I've crystallized that into the slogan that we use people before profits. And, and that means that I'm going to put the interest of somebody else above mine. Because when I do look out for them, they will in turn look out for me. And even if they end up not holding their end of the bargain, I'm still happy because I have done my part. And, and so you talk a lot about that. I've been inspired by your writings in that field. So why is it important for a dentist, um, uh, as a business owner, as a clinician, to put somebody else's interest first for him or her to have long-lasting well-being? Yeah. So it, not just the dentist, you know, we're, we're people too. Right, of course. <laughs> okay. Dentists are people too, that's right. Yeah, and it's, it's so easy to, um, to say that um, put others first. You know, but but really the question is why is that important? I mean, is, is just does it just sound right? Well, um, last year I finished up a program at University of Pennsylvania in positive psychology, and the late Chris Peterson, who taught at University of Michigan, was second to Marty Seligman, a great positive psychologist. And when asked what is positive psychology, he did it in three words. Just three words. The whole concept of positive psychology, he said, can be boiled down to three words, and they are other people matter. Nice. Other people matter. And so <laughs> understanding that and then just playing with that one phrase, well, what do you mean by that? And then I once heard a, a comparison. Chris Peterson also said that happiness is other people. Nice. And Jean-Paul Sartre said. Wow. Hell is other people. What a paradox. That's right. Therefore, other people really do matter. And so when you put your efforts to helping other people, things do change. And it, it comes, and I think it does, doesn't it reflect in, in, in really your business as well? Because now you're, now you're focusing on your team members, you're focusing on your patients, you're focusing on everybody that surrounds you in a practice. Uh, you're truly building that, that patient-centric practice that, that you know, uh, creates trust in the community. So you use the magic word, trust. Another one of these buzzwords that are out there, well, you gotta get people to trust you, yeah. okay? Well, that's great, how do you do that? You see, and so in my book, I talk about how to, how to become trustworthy, how to build trust, and um, one of the, the first thing, there are, five, there are five reasons I give in the book, and we can talk, to, talk about sure. them later, but the number one, sure. drop the agenda of self-focus. Drop your ego. Get rid of your ego, number one. People sense that. You wanna be trusted? Make sure that they know it's all about them and not about you. That's fantastic. I think it's a great uh, point to end on is dropping your ego and keeping your ego at the door. Now, or understand that's just one thing. Right, right. There are but I think things. it's got to start with there, right? Starts because right otherwise, there. otherwise you're not, you're closed. We'll continue the discussion more on, 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 on again, putting what, what it means to put people first and what it means to earn trust. Because the topic that is, is right now very crucial as dentistry goes through this evolution on how do we build trust? It, it, you gotta move the conversation from profits uh, to people, uh, and, and that transition has to happen. And that's how, I think if you do that, eventually you will end up making the profits. Sure, well, like I said before, you know, get what you need and you'll get what you want. Perfect, perfect.